there was there was one gentleman I was hoping to get your thoughts on if you remember him. Um, he was he pretty much started playing from from the start. Alan Cox. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, president, he was our yeah. president for 18 years. Yeah, he was. Uh, yeah, so I know a, a bit about Alan. Uh, he, uh, he lived uh, down in, uh, yeah, in Rockdale Way. Uh, and a bit of personal history, my cousin courted his daughter in the in the early day. Right, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so uh, I knew that uh, yeah. when, he, uh, when I joined the club, you know, so. But, uh, but that's all. Uh, he was an ordinary working man, Alan. Yeah. Uh, I think he was a fitter and turner from memory. Right. Yeah, but... Uh, he and his wife lived in a little cottage down in uh, Rockdale, or, yeah. Mm. I know where it is, I'll take it to it. It's still there, I can't really? it the other okay. week. But, uh, yeah, but that's all I know about Alan. I, mm. uh, he wasn't playing when I joined. Yes, OK. Right. So, uh, uh, but then he was the president. I oh, used to, uh, uh, he didn't have a car. Never had a car. Right. Right. And uh, which is uh, typical of when I joined. Yes. There was only a few cars okay. uh, among the club. Yes. Know? Not like now, everyone's got a, at least one. Yes. It was quite surprising. We all got to the grounds, you know, yes. uh, under our own steam. Okay. Uh, yeah. So, uh, uh, but I don't particularly remember doing that. I remember getting a lift with uh, uh, with a couple of people who had Harry Milburn. I I knew Harry well, and uh, he had an old Chevy, a 30, right, a thirty eight Chevy. Yeah, right. Because he um, was he was significant because he played for twenty years, president for twenty years, and then he was our patron as well. If I got this right, across our eighties and nineties, so. He, had a, had a lot to do with our club for a yeah, very he, long time. I know he, he finished in the uh, in the nursing home directly across the Stony Creek Road from the Bexley Oval. Yeah, yeah right, a good, good bloke, Alan. Yeah. 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 Oh. Obviously, I didn't play with him, yeah. and uh, and he'd just finished being president. Um, not long before I'd started, but I remember him. They used to come to the AGM, and I'm sure it was it was uh, it was Alan that would uh, ask a question, ask a couple of questions, say something positive about the financial statements, and ask for them to be. Uh, and he would uh, um, part, you know, pass them for uh, the motion. That, uh, and yeah, they came along a lot to the the AGMs and Kingsgrove RSL, and you'd see him down at the, the ground. And I think the last time I remember, he was in a, a wheelchair. He came down and his, uh, was his daughter, I think, that, that brought him along. So, yeah, he always- He's well, a committed man. He's very committed, and yeah, right to, right to the end, he was still thinking of the club. Mm. So, yeah, yes. Tomo obviously knew a lot more about him than, uh, than me, but, uh, that was the memories that I that I, have, I have of him. Mm. What do you remember about Alan? Alan? Alan was my was the president when I first played for the club. Yeah. He I I heard that he was in the first side ever, nineteen twenty nine. Mm. So he he'd actually been involved with the club for forty years. Okay. When, when I first met him. Yeah. Um, I got to know him a lot more. Uh, he came to the, come to the occasional game here at Bexley. Because uh, he lived local, um, I don't think I ever saw Alan without a tie on. Right. He was a well dressed gent and um, a, a true gentleman. Um, he uh, was uh, the president at the. I joined the general committee meeting. I think in the second season. Yeah. And so I I spent uh, a lot of um, time at committee meetings with Alan. Uh, true professional, had a dry sense of, of humour. 
Um, um, but he'd been in the role for quite a while. Yeah. And and he knew what he was doing. I I, I was I was a new kid on the block, but I can say that I I learned a lot just mm. from listening to him. Yeah. 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 Um, I got an idea he was a batsman in his day, but I, right. I couldn't tell you anything about his playing career. Yeah, okay. Yeah. 